I'm fiercely independent. But if you run, you're gonna have to run one or the other. Um, maybe. Well, if you had to choose, what would you choose? Probably Republican. I, I have my Trump hedge on. In the event Donald wins, I have no doubt in my mind the, the market tanks. And so I literally have put on a, a more than 100% hedge. Before we hit 23K, you were waiting to break it out. Now we've broken it out. We I know, I gave you a little teaser, right? I didn't even think it was going to be today. Oh, I was convinced it was going to oh, be. Oh, yeah. Yes, I yeah. It's time to start making the 24,000 happen. I went right out on a limb there. <laughs> yeah. I'm ready to tell the world that I'm here to endorse Hillary Clinton. You're fired. How come? Because I think there's a place for um, somebody who is socially a centrist, but I'm, I'm very fiscally conservative. But I think there's better ways now to make government smaller than the old traditional Republican ways. Again, using technology. You know, government as a service can have a dramatic impact on how we live our lives. If you don't understand technology, and you don't understand the impact on jobs that technology is going is having and will continue to have, then you're going to run into some severe roadblocks. And you I sound think, like a candidate. You know, it's I'm I'm a concerned American citizen. Oh, uh, right? so am I, but I'm not a candidate. You but sound I, like one. I have lots of time to focus on on trying to understand issues, and so, you know. I wouldn't run unless I have solutions. If I have solutions, then I have something to offer. If I don't, you won't see me anywhere near being a politician. I like you a lot, but that was BS because, <laughs> well, it was BS because you have basically, your whole life has been about solutions. And yeah. this is no different. So it seems to me that you're not just throwing your hands up in the air. You have an idea on how things well, should I'm be. Well, because I'm concerned. I'm well, concerned. I understand that. Yeah. But if you have ideas on what the solutions are, then you've crossed that line and you're going to run. No, not necessarily, not necessarily right? Because healthcare, to give you a perfect example, I think I have something that can be repeal and replace and serve and deal and cover 100% of the people that otherwise have to buy okay, individual you're insurance. Make, you're making my point. But but I don't have to run in order to introduce it. I have you to, just said that if you come up with solutions, then but I think would... I said I think. I don't think, I didn't say I have yet, right? Because there's still a lot of work to be done. Make, make America great again. Make America great again. Make it great again. Make it great again.